Here we are. It's just it's huge. It's pretty new. That's it. So obviously made of glass. Definitely renovated recently. Um, really big. Yeah, so we'll go check it out. Maybe I'll add the text later. I'm a guy, so I'm impressed by, you know, cars, engines, boat engines, large, powerful things. This building is massive. People. And then, it just goes nuts. So this train station, it's five levels deep. I mean, tracks, people, stores, the whole thing. So I'm going to try to show you that and try to help you grasp the size of this. Here we go. We've got a level on top of us. Actual trains. Supported by these gargantuous beams. Walking level that we are on that one. Next one is there. Elevator is going way down. And those are tiny little people there. So down there we've got, I think uh, if I sound correctly it was track four or five or six and seven, something like that. And then the trains keep going through there, and the tracks actually run across. Absolutely massive. Okay, so I have a little bit of information. I just quickly looked it up. That's why I know everything. Uh, the Brigitte, like all things that are in the capital of Germany, they always come huge. So, some information for you here. Let me just give you a little wrap up. They're very short, don't know a lot. But what I do know is that the main, this is the main open hall for Berlin. Uh, Berlin, Germany, obviously. And it is the largest crossing station in Europe. Of course. Of course, it's all complete. And this one opened the 26th of May, 2006. So it's obviously very, very new. All things German and European, there is a croissant store, a little croissant bakery, right here in the Hauptbahnhof, the main train station in Berlin. Of course, Bo has stopped to get a croissant. So let's go check out what they look like. Yeah, do you want anything other than uh, cheese and ham or a wiener? No, I don't want a wiener. Uh, ham. I'll take wiener. I got one of those for you. Okay, so upon Bo's request, we will be taking the elevator to the top and then to the bottom. This and of is going to be awesome. Filming it. <laughs> How is your croissant, please? Very fantastic. The nice thing about the toad that we're constantly baking them fresh, you actually shouldn't get anything older than maybe 15, 20 minutes. So they're still warm, fresh out of the oven. Mm. Mm. So top floor. <laughs> now we're going down. Very confused group of young women. <laughs> well, first we have to go all the way down.
Und Schuhe B. Untergeschoss 2, Bahnsteig 5, ja. 6. Und dann, wo gehen wir gehen? All the way. So down here we have like a gazillion tracks. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, I think it's something like ten tracks down there. Untergeschoss 1, mit Übergang zu den Bahnsteigen 1 bis 4 und 7, 8 zu den Reisezentren. Service Point und WC. And there we go. All the way to the top. Obergeschoss 2, Bahnsteig 11 und 12. In front of the building. So, and here we are on the top level of the train station, all the way on the roof. We have padding in the tracks, just in case you fall in. <laughs> I just made that up. I have no idea if it's true. So, this is where all the uh, streetcars leave from. So, your subway trains are six levels down, and these are your S-Bahn, which are your short little inner city trains. Above ground trains, but all local city trains, because the station also has the Deutsche Bahn, which is all the international trains and the long distance trains, which are also partially on this level. This level right there, there's an ICE right there. Right there, and it's closing his doors. Taking up. Intercity Express. The ass train. So he just shut his doors. Airtight steps folded in. And there's a guy in the front with this crank. And he's cranking it to get the engine started. Oh, yeah. that's ours. We're going towards Spundo. Now this station is so big that they actually have conductors on either sides of all the train tracks coming in. So if the train pulls in, there's somebody in the front, somebody in the back. That, so that means that if somebody um, jumps on the train or puts their hand out as doors are closing, etc., etc., and something happens the doors open again, the conductors then have to use the key, make sure everything's clear, whistle to the other person, making sure things clear, and then telling the captain that they can actually get away. The director. Train. Driver? Driver. Then they have to. Uh, I, know, I know he's got a name, but I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, we're racing the ice train.